Okay, so we're on uh, Rand's new toy, this wonderful rib that everybody's been looking at. And it's a very functional toy, came from uh, Florida, I believe. Nipper, uh, this is your new rib. Tell us a little bit about it. Where did it come from? Where did the idea come from? Um, we looked for an alternative for a protector. And obviously we found one. It's the same size as a normal common size. It's very comfortable with way more space for the sails. And it's so comfortable and dry to ride. It's very nice. We liked the idea and the concept of the boat and as we needed to step our boat up a little bit between, as we use the boat between the 52 and 72, this is a yeah, perfect work boat. Here in the front is a toilet and a little bit of luxury for Nicholas and Catherine. The coffee machine in here as well? It's maybe a little bit weird, but on boats, as everyone knows, everything is compromised and I think it doesn't look too bad. Down here, we have a big area for storage for spare parts and in the back we have another box. Down here we have lifting points. When we ship the boat, when we load the boats to go to America for example, it's nice to hoist with the center point lift to not dis destroy the tubes with slings. Here for example, easy to reach, we have two boxes of wet weather gear for the sailors. Then the sail repair kit, rope spares and deck hardware. Lots of a look in, inside here in the uh, saloon, as it were. Yeah, first of all, we have very nice Ullman spring suspended seats, so we don't end up with back problems when we are 50 or older. And here we have two big displays, one's to control the engines and one's for the charts. When we work here, before racing, we also can swap them all into charts. We have a Bluetooth system and was that we get all the data from the board onto the iPad so the coach has a full understanding where we add in the tuning process. And uh, the obvious question everyone wants to know, how fast is it? Fully loaded how it is right now, it's going about 47 knots. Like when it's empty and the tanks are nearly empty, you can reach 50 knots. Yeah, it's very nice. Tell us a little bit about the boat name for this uh, this rib. Or well, Dufa is um, part of the Rand story, and Rand is a Nordic goddess of the sea. And Dufa is one of the eight daughters. Our old tender was called Dufa, but we kept the same name because that is the easiest name to pronounce, apparently. It was very nice to have a work environment given like this by Nicholas and Catherine.